the Neezy gang to exactly. help us try to make a huge decision like this. This is big. This is big. Definitely could make a break. You must not want real kids, huh? We talking about that right now? Yeah, I'm talking about that right now. What are you doing? What are you doing? I'm shaving, Natalie. What are you? Get out, Natalie. <laughs> one, why are you in my robe? Two, why are you shaving with socks Which on? Which one do you shave? Shave my feet? Which one do? Which one do? And you why are you using my? Baby. Is that, bro? What you? Bro. What? I thought this was for me. Literally, you got this. Who's? It's mine, right? No, that is for my brother. What are you talking? It's for your brother. So you, you gonna blame it on your brother? Right you now. gonna use my Harry's gift set? For yourself when I thought it was, was for my brother me, baby why was it here i mean i get i guess you can use it too but it this wasn't it's for you it literally says it's unisex baby like I, for women and women like so let me tell y'all about my limited edition winston gift set okay so it has this really bomb handle that you can actually engrave it comes with three german engineered blades that give you a very close shave it's, oh yeah. yeah yeah amazing it also has foaming gel and a blade cover and let me tell y'all this is a high quality gift set right here it gave me a clue shave and it's for men and women they don't discriminate over here and the blade cartridges are only two dollars to refill guys one percent of the proceeds go to men and health veterans okay guys so copy you guys a hairy gift set it's going down we got ours it's lit and use our link okay our promo code so you can get five dollars off let's get and free shipping and free shipping okay get you a gift set What's up, Neezy gang? Gang, 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 yo. Today, we got a special guest, y'all. I would like you guys to officially, oh, you guys already met him, but the people that are new to this channel, welcome, welcome, make sure you guys subscribe. And I want to introduce my baby boy, Pluto. Hi, baby. It's been a while. Last time you were on this channel, baby, you was going to the vet, him was shiki poo. Today is about to be lit. We're gonna have a good day. You know, we're gonna have a little vloggy vlog and of course our special guest Pluto, the French on Instagram. Make sure you guys follow him. Instagram right there. If you guys don't know, I have another son as well. His name is Boss. I didn't forget about him, you know. I can't wait for him to meet. Pluto needs one more shot until he can meet his brother. I'm about to get in the car with Natalie right now. She's about to see her sonny poo poo. If you guys are new, make sure you guys hit that subscribe button. Remember, record your favorite part of this video. And look, you see me rocking my brand new chain and my baby got me. <laughs> it's about to go down. Sorry, my brother's thing. I ate a salad, y'all. I'm talking really fast. I feel like I'm really, really talking fast. Anyway, all right, Nisa Gay, let's get it popping. Let's get it popping. Quit it. What up, baby? Yeah, you oh. should have matched him. I know, huh? I didn't even think about it. I do got a flannel, too. That would have been dope. I know. Think of this. Hey, what's up? What's up? Yeah. What's new to you? What's new with you, beautiful? Um, you know, just running around, running, running some around. errands. Yes. So, yeah. so I thought I'd bring our little baby with us so he yeah. could run errands with us. Uh, you miss him. You miss him? He's getting mm -hmm. so big. He's look definitely at, growing into his Frenchy features. Yeah. Check out that. Check out that face. Ooh, look at that face. Look Pluto. At okay, let's get on the road. Let's get on the road. You ready? Yup. You ready, ready? Yeah, you gotta take him though, because this is a hazard. Oh yeah, he can't drive while holding a baby. And no. he, hand me my Pluty. Pluty booty. Oh my god, we're such a happy family. I know. Look, he's he just like you. <laughs> Oh, Natalie got the jokes, jokes, y'all. That's okay. He's handsome. And I'm handsome. He's so handsome. He's like, look, I am trying to lay down and go to sleep. Usually he's in his car seat, y'all. But, you know, I'm feeling a little risque. <laughs> he doesn't know about this film life. Yet. He doesn't know he about the film life. can't sleep when we have to film Yeah, we wake up. Wake up. <laughs> All right, Neezy gang. I'm walking up into Starbucks right now. Have you guys heard of Starbucks literally not having a drive-thru? Like, I didn't even know that didn't exist anymore. But I wanted to take a minute with you guys real quick um, and tell y'all that I have been seeing your comments a lot asking whether or not Easy and I are going to move in together. So I decided, you know, I'm gonna ask her. I'm gonna get some Starbucks and then we're gonna talk about it in the car. So get ready. Ooh baby what this here so you got the vanilla chai tea latte okay fancy and i got the caramel brulee 
Wait a minute, wait a minute. Why you get that one? Because I know you're picky and I know you like that. I didn't want to get you something that I didn't know if you would like. Baby, I like caramel though, too. I like caramel. You know, I love caramel. You can start with saying thank you, babe, for my vanilla chai tea latte. Thank you, Natalie. I appreciate you. I'm so sorry. I got too comfortable. Yeah, huh? I'm great. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. What you get, Pluto? They do have dog treats in there, don't they? They do, and you didn't get them one? I didn't think about you didn't it. get your baby one, Pluto. Listen, What's pop, I lock, and dropping? Them. I was going to ask you a question. Ooh, there she go again with these Something questions. That they want to know. Okay. They want to know. What do they want to know? And when did, wait, where did you hear this information? Because I didn't hear it. Did I hear it? It's what? because, you know, the prank queen really just cares about wow. family, her kneesy game. What? So I no, actually really no. pay attention no. to them. There's no way you could sit here and say that. Everybody can justify from our last few videos ago, I am the ultimate prank queen. That is already a given. You have to earn that crown. Don't Girl. try to take it. Earn it. Okay. So they want to know. Oh, they want to know. When are we going to move in together? I mean, sheesh. They want to know. <gasps> when are we going to move into the old oh, this? Who that? Big old truck. Hold up, in our grill. Move your head. Let me see what it looks like. Oh, okay. I love the way you're changing the subject and stuff, too. What? What are you talking about? <laughs> oh, girl. Ah! Big old truck. Like, they ain't worried about us. They is worried about us. Honestly, that's a, you know, a tough question because it's like, who's to say that we're going to be together forever, you know? Last time I said that, he told me not to say that. You right, you right. Okay, all right. You right, you right. Okay, honestly though, until her lease is up, that's when we moving in together, right? So we honestly, let me, let, well, let's ask her advice. Okay. Let's ask her advice, because we, we're honestly just not sure. So not this sure. is something that we, you know, think we need to talk about. Talk about with an easy about. game. Okay, let's Maybe y'all can give us some good life advice. Give all us right. some advice. So here's the thing. So you guys know I moved into my apartment about four months ago. Yep. Right? She been living. I've been living on my own. Okay. She really grown. Great. She been adult. That's what I'm talking about. No all way. right. Got my own place. Right? Okay. okay. And that was a struggle too because we had to decide like it, it took a lot of growing up to be like dang are we gonna live together or yeah. are we going to get our own spots get our own places yeah. you know and it would have been easy to live together but the hard part was to say like i think that where we're at yeah and, and we just had gotten together new, yeah and you know i've never lived on my own before i think that i owe it to myself and we yeah. owe it to this relationship to take our time yeah. and have our own places and stuff and so far that has been really good but since i have him like now i've been spending a lot of time apart with natalie because i got responsibilities he's like a real baby you know that's gonna be you know i think a decision maker because i know that you don't really want well we're gonna talk about that in a second we're gonna talk about that in a second all right do y'all think that we made the right decision by living separately at first. The second question that we have is, when is too soon to like move in together? Because, so I'm four months into my lease already. Yeah. The year mark is gonna be right around the corner. And- like that, 2021. Dang, I'm not gonna lie to y'all. I really do like living by myself though. Man, I feel like it has done wonders for our relationship. I'm not gonna lie. Like, nah, she ain't lying. No, I love it too. Even even when we were just like best friends and stuff, of course we were still yeah. butt heads because we were together 24 seven. We basically lived together yeah. without having all our stuff in the same place. It's good to have that space. Sometimes you need it, you know, especially to work better, you know? And to give our, ourselves the chance to miss each other. Exactly. You know, like we work out together every morning and then it's nice that I go home to my apartment exactly. and I shower and I get ready. I, mm -hmm. I meditate and journal. I have my routine. You and know I what go I mean? home or I'm already at home and then I gotta clean up dog poop and you know play with my son and then I gotta go play with my other son so he don't feel jealous boss it's like a whole routine for me so when is too soon okay right. like when is too soon to move in together because really we were honestly thinking after this year leases up mm -hmm. that we will start looking for a house to get together yeah so then here's the next concern oh damn how many more concerns you got easy has two dogs 
I do. I got two. That's sons. what you were gonna bring up earlier, mm-hmm. and I was like, wait, 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 wait. Oh, is that not yet? Okay, so now I can talk about it. So now you can talk about it. Go ahead. Okay, so my biggest con- not concerns, but I do come with not only one dog, but my brand new dog, my baby Pluto. You know, and if Look you guys, who? if you guys don't know, um, Natalie, she's very bougie. And look, she, she see how she hit me? She thought I was gonna say something crazy. <laughs> me? Bougie? Yes, Natalie is very bougie and she likes her house a certain way. But now that I have two sons, it's like, okay, how are we gonna do this? This is kind of coming, not coming between us, but it's gonna be a big thing that we need to discuss and how is this gonna work? <laughs> oh, she you know? Has two sons, y'all. Yeah, oh two sons. God, I cannot. And, you know, like I said, Natalie is really bougie, so we have to figure that out and work it out. So, yeah. Ah, uh, what do y'all think? You know what I'm saying? Like, obviously, we're gonna have to figure it out out give us some ad- an agreement that we can have you know because the thing is yes with boss face. i didn't really mind because i was like all right i just know we're gonna have to get a house with a yard because boss is an outside dog you know she would let him come in sometimes yeah but majority you know, of the time he's outside dog. most majority of the time he's outside but Checking with pluto you know i i guess she wants him to be an outside and inside dog and I think with this type of dog, you kind of have to. I don't know. Yeah, you know, he's, yeah. bougie. he's bougie. All right, she oh. thinks I'm bougie. He's bougie. He's bougie, bougie. I've been racking my brain, you know, trying to think ahead before my lease is up. Okay. Like a year from now. Uh-huh. And I'm like, all right, what can I do, basically, to okay. meet somewhere in the middle? Okay. And okay. okay. Well, we could make sure we get a house that has a space for them that okay. has its own doorway. Ooh, like, so a, that, like it's literally their room. Yes, but not that not that you have to bring them through the house, but like say like a garage or something like that. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? What or say? like a side like laundry area. <laughs> oh, or, okay. You know what I'm saying? Like yeah, yeah, yeah. where they have it has its own door. Mm-hmm. Um, you can have their little beds in there. There and yeah. you can keep it clean in there, but they don't have to be in like the main part of the house, you know. <laughs> I was thinking that is a great compromise because it's you know looking out for the little pups, you yeah. know, and and all that. What do you think, Poo Poo? You want your own room? Yeah. So whatever my man cave is, that's where my dogs are gonna be. Exactly. Yeah. Okay. And there and you know, like I said, there has to be Compromise. like an entrance for them and an exit for them. And if there isn't, well, we can't. If, are we gonna buy our first house? That's another discussion. That's another, that's another discussion. discussion. Okay. All because right. Because honestly, I just feel like yeah. I I have my ways of doing things right. in the house, you know, and our house is gonna be bougie too, you know. I want it to be really clean and stuff like that, and right. yeah, that's kind of hard to so do. So you know that you have to like, you know, my house is clean too. So it's like no, I know, but you yeah. know me. What she's talking about and clean, she's talking about like, oh, I want white carpet. Oh, I want a pink couch. I don't oh, want, I want see Versace a speck mirrors. Of fur. Right. So that's her definition of clean, which is like she wants everything to look clean as far as what she purchases. So getting dogs with a white white rug wouldn't work out. Right. You know, getting a dog with a pink couch isn't gonna work. Describing her apartment, she's clean too. Yeah, don't get me wrong. Don't play. But it. it's just you know we we just have different taste taste, and I don't know if you guys can think of any other type of compromise where you can you know both of our concerns and stuff comment that below because we are open ears and we need the Neezy gang to exactly. help us try to make a huge decision like this This is big this is big that we can make or break us right girl this ain't making breaking nothing what you talking about if my dogs can't come this is a make or break okay you must not want real kids huh we talking about that right now Anyway, all right, all right, it's getting too spicy in here, Nisi Gang. You playing with you? you? Beat me. <laughs> all right, Nisi Gang, are we wrapping it up? Because the, the topic was getting a little juicy. You know what I'm saying? But got, guys, please comment below what you guys think. We really need your help, and y'all know we read our comments. Okay, so spam the comments. So with all that being said, give this yes, video so a huge thumbs up. Yes, so we can stuff. do our share for share. Oh yes, what we do definitely. With every video. Exactly. So make sure you guys give this video a huge thumbs up. Spam the comments right now. And I just want to end this video off saying I. Love you and I am the prank queen. All right, Nisa Gang, we out.